All right, Andrew McGinnis joined by Dondre Reddick, Santa Fe X Men. Unbelievable game, 21 points on the boards as well, dishing the ball. How were you able to find your spot so early in the game? Uh, first things first, I just wanted to start off with a defensive mindset. My coach is preaching that, so I'm big on if we get defensive stuff, the game will just come to me. And I thought that's what happened. You speak about the defense. I mean, you guys, you know, three pointers, getting to the free throw line, but how important is it for you guys to keep that defensive mentality going in the championship game? Well, defense sets the tone. And we have a saying, have fun being dominant. And when we think of dominant, we think of defense first. Because we're a transition team, but we can also shoot the ball. But when we get out, it's scary things happen. We asked Coach Vernon yesterday about leadership on your team. He said everybody in their own way is a leader. You've obviously been on this team for many years. What does it mean to you to be a leader for the X-Men? Uh, me, I just, I'm just trying to be a vet that I can be. I'm just trying to, right now, I just told him, when you get to the playoffs, it's all about winning. It's all about winning. We don't need, don't worry about stats. If we win, everyone looks good. So I just try to bring that energy that I can control. Obviously, we're seeing the respect you're getting. Uh, the St. Avex alumni, fans, friends, family out here. What does it mean to you to see so many people here supporting you? It's great, man. I went to school in Anakinis, but I also went to school in Halifax for numerous of years. So it's just great to see people cheering for me. How do you put this win behind you and get ready for tomorrow's big game? Uh, you enjoy the moment right now, but as soon as I get in that locker room, it's next game mindset because the job is not finished. And what would it mean for you guys to go back to back, be uh, defending champions, and win again uh, tomorrow? It's not easy to go back to back, but for me, it just it'd be a blessing because I'm in my fourth year eligibility, so I don't know if I'm coming back. But if we go back to back, that'll put a great feeling in my heart. Describe the challenge of both St. Mary's and Dalhousie. What do those teams bring to the table? Um, the, first of all, we respect both of them. They're great teams, and to be honest, it's just playoff basketball, and everyone wants to win, so everyone's gonna play hard. So. You can't doubt anyone. Wish you the best of luck. Thank you, man. I appreciate Thank you very that. Much.